Is R. Kelly proof that there's no such thing as bad publicity? The controversial singer is reportedly seeing a big spike in sales following the airing of that scathing Lifetime TV documentary, Surviving R. Kelly. The six-part series tells harrowing stories of alleged sexual abuse by the singer. Can you describe the physical abuse? <laughs> Despite the allegations, streams of his music on Spotify have jumped 16%, and that is perplexing actress Jada Pinkett Smith. I'm having a really difficult time understanding why, but I think it's important that I understand why. I really would like for you guys to help me understand what I'm missing. Jay-Z, Lady Gaga, and several other big names are being called out today by the executive producer of the Lifetime documentary for reportedly declining to be interviewed for the program. Private flights, crazy schedule. Gaga and R. Kelly have performed together on several high-profile TV appearances. In a 2013 news conference, Gaga appeared to be defending the singer. R. Kelly and I have sometimes very untrue things written about us. So, in a way, this was a bond between us. John Legend was the only big star to speak out in the documentary. It shows you how rich and powerful men can get away with a lot of things. To everyone telling me how courageous I am for appearing in the doc, it didn't feel risky at all. I believe these women, and I don't give a blank about protecting a serial child rapist. A representative for Kelly calls all allegations of physical abuse and sexual misconduct false. Tomorrow, we will sit down with three of Kelly's accusers to hear their side of the story.